Vlog year day 24. So today I am leaving for Bangkok. I'm actually leaving tonight and it is about an 18 hour flight from Los Angeles to Bangkok. I have a direct flight and um, I believe Bangkok is 15 hours ahead of Los Angeles. So I'm leaving here on Tuesday and I will arrive in Bangkok on Thursday morning, which is kind of crazy because I'm like time traveling and skipping over Wednesday, even though I'm not really time traveling, but it's kind of weird and cool at the same time. So I'm just here waiting for Luke to pick me up because he went to the gym to work out with Joey and then he's coming here to pick me up and then I think we're going to his house and we're just gonna hang out for a little bit before I, um, he takes me to the airport. So I have all of my stuff packed here, so I figured I would show you guys. So here is my main bag. This is the bag that I'm going to be checking. It's really not that big at all, but I don't need a huge bag because I don't plan on doing a ton of shopping. If I get anything, it'll probably be like small little things that I can easily fit in here because I have plenty of room left in this bag. It's nowhere near full. So I just have a couple pairs of pants here, a scarf, my American flag scarf from Free People, and then I have some pajamas t-shirts and then down here just tops to wear during the day and then I have a pair of pajama shorts a pair of long pants for pajamas um, because I'm not sure how cold it'll be or how hot it will be because it just kind of depends on how cold the air conditioning is because you have to sleep with the air conditioning on um, in Thailand because it gets so hot and then underneath I have my dual voltage straightener and hair dryer so they're really small and light which is great and I can use them anywhere in the world and I don't have to worry about them exploding and then here I have hair products and body products for like the shower so my shaving cream dry shampoo and then I brought my lush I love juicy my flying fox shower gel and my shampoo bar I was originally just gonna bring this because I used it this morning actually not this one. I used the green one. I can't remember what the name is, but um, in here is the blue shout or shampoo bar. And I actually really, really like the shampoo bars. I was very surprised. I didn't think they would be um, that great. I was kind of skeptical about them, but they actually lather up really, really well. So I brought this, but then I decided to bring my I Love Juicy shampoo just in case I need something to really get my hair clean because I'm sure I will be sweating a lot in Thailand because it's very hot and humid. I checked the weather. It's like 91 degrees and it's been raining. So yeah will definitely need a good shampoo at some point. And then here I just have like face products, toothpaste, face wash, deodorant, and here just miscellaneous stuff. I brought a couple nail polishes, um, my makeup setting spray, and a body spray. And then here I have a couple bracelets from Fleur, these little wrap bracelets. Um, I just wanted to bring these because they're bright and fun and I thought they would be good to wear while I'm in Thailand. And then I just have my hairbrush and this down here is heat protectant and cotton pads. So that's pretty much it for this suitcase. And like I said, if I bring anything back, most of it will probably just fit right here. I try and put all of the heavy stuff down towards the bottom where the wheels are so that way um, my clothes don't get crushed and I think it just works out better that way. If you put like shoes down at the bottom or anything that's heavy like toiletries, stuff like that, it always works out better to have that stuff at the bottom. And then I just put this stuff, these um, pair of pants over the top just so things wouldn't like fly around so things are a little bit more secure since there is quite a bit of room left in there. And then over here I have my little carry-on bag. I originally wasn't going to bring a little wheelie bag but then I realized that I wanted to bring my big camera, my T3i, because I want to take some good pictures and maybe do a little collage video like Joey did for Catalina, so I'm bringing this camera so I can get some good footage. And this takes up quite a bit of space, so it wouldn't fit in my Longchamp tote bag. So I just decided, well, I will just put everything in this carry-on bag and then just carry my little Rebecca Minkoff bag, and that's all I will bring on the plane. So this kind of works out well because I can fit everything in here. I had my laptop case on top, but my laptop isn't in here yet. It's over on the counter, but... 
I just put that on top so my laptop will go on top of everything. And then here I just have a spare change of clothes. I have a little hoodie in case it gets cold on the plane and then an extra t-shirt and I also have an extra pair of underwear packed in here because I've learned my lesson to pack a spare change of clothes when you're traveling because I have lost my bag before. I lost my bag when I flew to New York City last year for IMATS. So I have learned to pack a spare change of clothes. So I have that just in case my luggage gets lost. And then I also have some sunscreen because I will need to put that on before I get off the plane. Some moisturizer because my skin gets really dry on long flights. And then I have like sanitizer and eye cream also because my skin gets dry. All of the makeup that I'm taking is in this little molten bag molten brown molten brown bag here so really small nice and compact and then I have my camera bag so my t3i is in here and I have um, the charger and everything as well so that is pretty much everything I'm taking to Thailand and, and then I just have over here my passport and my flight information and then my little Rebecca Minkoff bag that I will be using as my handbag while I'm in Thailand. I just wanted something small, something that I could throw over my shoulder or wear it across my body, something really light and something that wouldn't weigh me down. So, so that is pretty much it for today and I guess I will see you guys in Thailand. Um, I will be vlogging while I'm in Thailand, but those vlogs won't be posted until after I return next week because internet out there is not very reliable. So sometimes I'll have internet, sometimes it'll be really slow, sometimes I won't have internet. So um, in the meantime, Luke has been kind enough to offer to upload the question and answer videos that I shot over the past few days. So there will be nine videos going up on this channel and in each in each video, I answer five questions. So once I get back, all of my Thailand vlogs will be up and yeah, I'm gonna miss Luke and I'm gonna miss all my friends. And it's really sweet of him to offer to help me upload these videos. He's also going to be uploading two beauty videos for me on my main channel while I'm away. So keep your eyes peeled for those. And I think that's pretty much it. So I guess I will just do a quick little outfit of the day for you guys. This is like the travel edition. It's nothing fancy. I'm wearing my Wild Fox Couture jumper. This is my number nine one. And then I have my J. Crew pixie pants on and my indigo Uggs. And I'm not wearing any makeup because I'm sure my skin will get very dry on the plane, so I'll need to be applying moisturizer. So it's just more comfortable for me to travel without makeup on. Sometimes I travel with makeup on, but since this is such a long flight, I'm just, I'm just not even going to think about it. So I hope you all have a fantastic day and I will see you in my question and answer videos and when I get back from Thailand. Bye!